Hey guys, it's me, Holly. So today's video is just going to be you and me, okay? Um, I'm not going to be using any props. It's just going to be my voice, okay? And my hands. Um, so if this isn't your kind of video, that's totally fine. I'll see you in the next one, okay? I also apologise if it's, it gets a little bit noisy outside sometimes. Um, I really wanted today um, to be a chance for us to focus on our breathing together and really be directing, um, directing this video especially to people who may be struggling um, with anxiety right now or um, even if you're just really stressed and needing to relax yourself Maybe you're in bed, um, struggling to get to sleep, and you just need something to help your mind shut down and your body just relax a bit, okay? So that's what I hope um, I'm able to do for you today, okay? Um, so I want us to start with, with some breathing exercises, okay? Okay, so... First breathing exercise is um, we're gonna do some deep breathing, okay? I really like the four, seven, eight breathing technique. Um, I've been finding that works quite well for me at the moment, but anyway, I'll talk more about it a bit later. Let's just hurry up and get started. Um, so, if you're able to or if you'd like to, um, it may be good to put hand on, on your chest and the other on your stomach, okay? That's really just to help you get a sense of feeling where you're breathing from, okay? And the aim is that when you are inhaling, you are feeling your stomach fill up, sort of like a big balloon, okay? You should feel it inflating. So your stomach should be rising before your chest, okay? Exactly, and that is going to be the best way to start to fill up your lungs with the most amount of air possible and really just start this process of relaxing your body, okay? Okay, so I want you to breathe in through your nose and count to four. It can be out loud or in your head, it doesn't matter, but just follow along with me. And then I want you to hold your breath, okay, for seven, seven seconds. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And release slowly through your mouth for the count of eight seconds. Four, five, six, seven, eight. Good job. Okay, so that's the general premise of it. All right, is that you breathe in for four. Hold for seven and you exhale through eight. Now, when you're exhaling, you can either um, you can either do this through your mouth and um, through like pursed lips. So instead of letting all of the air go out at once, like uh, it's meant to go really slow, okay? Like a really slow and controlled exhale. Um, if that doesn't feel right for you, because sometimes that doesn't always feel right for me. Or maybe if you're in public and you don't want people to notice um, that, you're, you're, that you're breathing like this, um, you might like to do it through your nose as well. And don't be put off if you feel like you have to do it through your nose, it won't work. Because it can still work that way just fine, okay? Okay. So when we try it together again, okay? So we'll breathe in for four. Hold. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and release. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I'm going to do a couple with you now, and I'm going to be quiet, so I'm doing it with you. And that way, you might like to even count at your own pace. Don't feel like 
like you have to go along with with my number and then I can be a little bit off off putting. So go at your own pace and we're gonna do a couple together. So don't forget to breathe in from your stomach, okay, not your chest. As you breathe out, really try and be mindful of your body and where you're sitting or laying right now. And just really try to let go of any stress or tension that may be in your body. Okay. Great. Let's try again. So breathing in. stress of your day just let it all leave your body again try not to think about all the responsibilities you have tomorrow because this isn't the time to do them this is the time to relax your body to take care of your body and feel well rested not be so stressed and your muscles so tight just want you to be as relaxed as possible okay that's it There is another breathing exercise um, that we could do if that one wasn't for you and it's called box breathing. I'll just do, do a little quick demonstration with this one. We won't spend too much time on it. You might already be feeling um, quite relaxed just from the last one. four seconds and holding for four seconds and then exhaling for four seconds okay and so it's four 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 it's all all even like a square okay you want to do it together okay let's do it so make sure you're nice and comfortable first okay make sure your mind is clear very hard to do this when we're riddled with our thoughts. So just clear your thoughts for a moment. It's just you and me. That's all that matters right now is you and me. Okay. Let's try this. Are you ready? hold for four seconds. One, two, three, four. Exhale for four seconds. One, two, three, four. 
and hold. Inhale again. One, two, three, four. Hold. One, two, three, four. Exhale. One, two, three, four. And hold. you like different breathing exercises work for different people and where you are at on your journey don't be too hard on yourself if you feel like you have lots of thoughts coming into your mind or even if you feel like you're struggling to fit your breath into the counts it's okay it's okay and maybe when for the first time kind of thing or if you're doing this when you're already really really stressed and really short of breath it might be really hard for you to to get those counts going it might be really hard for you to breathe in a certain amount and exhale a certain amount but if you do feel like you have to adjust them a little bit maybe make them a little bit shorter Especially for the four, seven, eight one. That's fine. That's totally fine. Like if you can only hold for five seconds instead of seven, do that. If you can only exhale for six, do that. The whole point is that it's meant to relax you and not stress you out. And that's definitely still learning if you like to be perfect in everything you do like me <laughs> I just want to focus on relaxing our body now and just do a little bit of a body scan together okay so make sure you're nice and comfortable We've done our breathing now. I hope that you're already starting to feel a bit relaxed. So just trying to stay nice and still. Are we going to start thinking about your head? We're going to start from the head and go down to our feet, okay? I want you to start relaxing your head. And this is even better if you're laying down, but if you're sitting, that's okay, we can still work with that, that's fine. I want you to focus on just relaxing your head, okay? Just slowly feel your head softening, feel your eyes closing, any stress or tension in your face, I want you to feel it let go. And just drop. Okay. And same with your cheeks, with your mouth. See if it all relaxes. Chin and your jaw. Now slowly trail down. And start feeling your neck. still be breathing as well now your shoulders we hold lots of tension in our shoulders so just try to let it all go like with every bit of you that gets relaxed it's like all of the stress is leaving your body okay now just keep going down and Feeling yourself getting heavier and heavier into your bed, into your chair, into the floor, wherever you are doing this from. Try and be mindful of where your body makes contact with the furniture. Okay. So trailing it down. And 
feel and relax and let go. That's it. Letting it all go. And you're safe here with me. But in this moment, you're okay. You're gonna be okay. We keep training down now. go of any tension you have in your hips, now down slow, going down your thighs, down your legs, feeling your legs getting heavier and heavier, pressing into the way down to your feet and your toes. That's it. Now focus on your whole body. Bring it all back together. Giving your whole body nice relaxed pressing deep to the furniture that you're sitting on or laying on. That's it. Just focusing on my voice. And your breath. Filling with oxygen. And then letting even take a moment to just appreciate some of the things that we that we love in our lives. Appreciate just just little things even like our body keeping us alive in this moment. doing exactly what it's supposed to do. Can you think of other little things in your life that, that maybe you're grateful for? And this can be helpful if you might be feeling a bit bit hard done by, like things are really, really difficult right now. Can we refocus our mind? Just to think of a few positive things. And no, that doesn't mean it invalidates the problems you've been having. It's just to balance out your thinking. Balance your thoughts. Sometimes, when the scales tip and things get really dark, it's really hard to see the things we're fighting for, the things that give us purpose, the little things that we love in life. Whether that's a hot shower. certainly something that I love. <laughs> um, sipping on your coffee in the morning, if you drink coffee. Maybe it's sleeping next to somebody that you love. Maybe it's feeling strong enough. even see how far you've come. And don't forget, it's 
so easy to discount all of our past achievements and focus on all of our problems now and what we can't do now. But just think about where you were before and how hard these things were for you. The things that you may have thought you can't possibly do. That it's too heartbreaking, too challenging. You will never be able to get through it. And then think to where you are right now and how far you have come and that you are still here and you are still fighting and growing learning and that's all okay for doing exactly what you should be and even if you you might feel like you're still in this bit right now that you're still back here hurting and struggling but just know that things like the seasons. Nothing stays the same. They can change. And so can we. I know you're gonna be okay. I hope you're feeling a little bit more relaxed after watching this struggle.